1 Thessalonians 5.21. Prove all things. Hold fast to that which is good. Abstain from some forms of evil. Is that what it says? No. It says to abstain from every form of evil. And so if we know that certain genres are just genres of rebellion, for instance, we talk about rap or hip hop or, or death metal. Those have a certain philosophical idea attached to them. Anger, rage, rebellion. We can't put a Jesus song and attach it to anger, rage, and rebellion. It is an evil form. It's unacceptable. Does that make sense? Now, before we proceed, here's a few items to clarify. We are not here to judge anyone's heart, only their fruit. We can be fruit inspectors, amen? We can. The Bible says that. We judge, you shall know them by their fruit, amen? I am not going to offer my personal opinion based on my music preferences. For instance, I just don't like country music, but there are certain ways you can put country music together that's acceptable for the listener as a Christian. My wife likes it more than I do. I just don't understand. But that's okay. That I, I, I pray for her. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, the, 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 that's okay. But that's, that's what's so beautiful about music. There are many different genres, and I don't have to like them all, but I'm not going to offer my opinion. I'm going to give you facts. Fair enough? Amen. That's how it should be. And of course, we need God's perspective, not Christian Bredahl's. And we need God's guidance while we examine and reason through this more sensitive subject. So I'd like to have a quick additional prayer. If you would, bow your heads with me. Father, I am not here to judge anyone's heart, and we are not going to do that. Father, we're here to look at the fruit of maybe using the wrong types of music. I pray that you would be with each one of us and help us to reason together.